These are some of the musicals that are coming to Broadway this year. Let's Cheekle chat about it. Cheekle? Welcome to Cheekle Chat. It's your boy Cheekle. You guys are probably looking around Times Square or Broadway and you're trying to see a new show you want to see. And you're like, oh, I've seen Phantom of the Opera like 10 hundred times. It's going to close. Or, oh, I saw Six like a year ago. And it's like, oh, are there any new musicals coming out? Well, there are some in previews and there are some coming soon this month or some time of the season. And you guys want to check them out, be sure to go on to Playbill. That's where I got some of my references and some research with that. Also, subscribe to this channel for more great content. Give this video a thumbs up just because I said so and you guys love me and make sure you guys let me know in the comments below is there a musical that you want to see on Broadway? Oh, there's a ton and I wish I'm back in New York, but it is what it is. Anyway, let's go through some of the new musicals that are coming this year. Now for the first few, we're just gonna talk about the ones that are currently in previews, but they are gonna have an opening sometime this month. Starting off with Bad Cinderella. This is gonna be written by Andrew Lloyd Webber, who is famously known for doing musicals like Cats, Jesus Christ Superstar, and guys, can we not forget to mention about Phantom of the Opera? right like he was known for that now this is going to be at the imperial theater and it's currently in previews right now but this musical is going to open on march 23rd now this is a musical that's pretty much like a modern version of the fairy tale cinderella i don't know what the songs are quite yet but they are going to uh do a reimagining of cinderella that they originally did at west end and it's coming to Broadway. Now we do have a couple revivals and both of these are currently running in previews on Broadway. We have Parade at the Bernard B. Jacobs Theater and it is starring Ben Platt and Michaela Diamond. Now I don't know much about Parade but I think this is its first revival ever since it was on Broadway so it kind of seems like a great imagining of it. Again I need to look into what Parade is about. And another one and I'm really surprised that it's actually in previews right now that is going to be Sweeney Todd and that is going to star Josh Groban and Niall Ashford, Jordan Fisher, and many others to list. This will be at, at the Lund Fontaine, Fontaine Theater. I'm, I'm butchering names for both actors and theaters. You can tell I haven't been in New York in a very long time. But anyway, this is a classical Hal Prince, Stephen Sondheim musical that they have worked together and has been revived numerous times. I love the idea of Josh Groban being Sweeney Todd. I feel like I just have to go to New York just to see that. That would be a treat. Now, for the dates for both these musicals when they open, it is actually March 16th for the Parade Revival, and it's March 26th for the Sweeney Todd Revival. Next up, we have Dancing, which is a Bob Fosse concept musical. It's based off the choreography of Bob Fosse. It's at the Music Box. It is in previews right now, and its opening is going to be on March 19th. Now, there's another musical that just made previews yesterday, and that is Camelot, and it's at the Lincoln Center at the Vivian Beaumont Theater. I've been there a few times to watch a few plays and few musicals. It is a good menu. Now, of course, this musical is going to be opening on April 13th, and it's a revival of Camelot, I believe. I don't know much about it, but I think it's a comedy. I could be wrong. Or is that Spamalot? You can tell I did a lot of research before making this video. The next musical is going to be New York, New York. I mean, of course, it's in New York. Uh, is it is it Frank Sinatra based? I'm so curious. Why else would they name it this way? By the way, it's going to be at the St. James Theater. It is going to make its first preview on March 24th, and it will open on April 26th. So it looks like the writers are going to be John Kander for music, Fred Ebb for lyrics, Lin-Manuel Miranda, additional lyrics. Dave Thompson is the writer for the book, I think, and so is Sharon Washington. Susan Stroman is the director. I didn't know that Lin-Manuel Miranda was working on this. This is pretty interesting. The musical will use John Kander and Fred Ebb songs with new ones by Kander and Lin-Manuel Miranda to devastate a post-World War II New York in recovery. Okay, Lin-Manuel Miranda is a big name on Broadway right now. I'm, okay. Here's another interesting one. They're doing a musical with Britney Spears songs. It's called Once Upon a One More Time. That, that's a weird way to roll the tongue with that. Once Upon a One More Time. 
Okay. This is going to be at the Marquee Theater. It's going to have its first preview on May 13th. And it will open on June 22nd. I mean, listen, it's Britney Spears music. And then, of course, the book is John Hartmere. And it's directed by Keon and Mari Madrid. Yeah, it's a Britney Spears musical for what it looks like. Awesome. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just not a fan. Great Scott. They're doing a Back to the Future musical at the Winter Garden. What? I would never imagine they would do this, but they're actually doing this. This has to be a rock musical. I mean, it has Marty McFly. I mean, it has to. This will be at the Winter Garden where they recently had the Music Man, the revival, which I wish I would have seen, but I just didn't. I had friends in that ensemble. Gosh. Anyway, the first preview will be June 30th and opening is going to be August 3rd. This is probably going to be a fun musical to watch. John Rando is the director. Writers are Alan Silvestri and Glenn Ballard for musical and lyrics and Bob Gale for the book. Obviously, it's based off of the blockbuster of 1985 film, the Back to the Future. Of course, I shouldn't have to explain that part, but it seems like there's like rock music in this. I could be wrong. I mean, it feels like it has to, but hey, that's pretty dope. So yeah, guys, those are some of the musicals that are coming soon or will open soon this month on Broadway. I think overall, if I was back there, I would definitely watch the dancing musical that is like Bob Fosse stuff. I would want to see Josh Groban as Sweeney Todd and Sweeney Todd. And oh my goodness, they're gonna do a Back to the Future musical. That, what? I, I'm not ready for that one. That is awesome. Anyway, let me know in the comments below which musical do you want to see. And we will see you guys back next week for a Q&A. That's right, March 17th. Mark your calendars and submit your questions because we are doing a Q&A. Just put down hashtag AskGlaze so that we know exactly you're asking the question for the Q&A and I'll answer them to the best of my ability. Also, I just love Q&As and I just haven't done them in a long time. So anyway guys, we'll see you guys next time. Peace out.